Let's look at the pendulum from the point of view of energy conservation. I'm going to lift a 7 kilo ball, 1.7 meters from its original starting point, and walk it over here to this wall, against which I will stand, bring the bowling ball up to my chin. It has 120 joules of energy, potential energy, which will be converted into kinetic energy when I let it go, back to potential energy at the other end of the swing, back to kinetic energy at the bottom, and potential back here. That energy gets converted to kinetic energy, back to potential energy, kinetic, and back to potential energy. If there had been no losses in the system, it would have come back to exactly the same spot. Doesn't quite make it because there's some air friction and some friction in suspension. However, this time I'm going to impart a little bit of initial energy into the system, enough to overcome the air friction and the friction up in suspension. If I do it just right, it will come back to exactly the same point as it started from. I gave it a push, goes out, comes back. Too much energy. <laughs> 